What's up guys? Jake Sleesman, Blue Collar Outdoors, and I just got out of work, checked the mail, enjoying a nice bush latte, and I saw a product has shown up. Actually, there's a couple of them, but one in particular that I've been wanting to add to our test series. It just makes life simpler, and it will also work in our duck blinds, etc. So, stay tuned for the unboxing. Get the hoodie off, change a little bit. It's a long day at work, you know, to me. So, stay tuned. And we're back. Okay, so, here we go. Let's open this. I already know what this bad boy is, but first off, I gotta say the shipping on this was insane. I'll drop the Amazon link down below to this item. As you can tell, I got two of them. But the shipping was stupid fast, especially amid COVID. So this, uh, it was insane how fast it got here. But what this is, the OTDR Shotgun Buddy Pro. And I got it in both colors. This is graphite gray right here. And then the, the blaze orange. I've been wanting to try these out for a while. Mainly for the shotgun pattern series. I got tired of leaning all our guns up, up against my truck and scratching the paint, which I don't really care too much about it, but it'd be nice to have an alternative method. And this right here is that. So first you can see there's an adjustable strap on the side here. This sucker's pretty versatile. I mean, whether it's a metal or a wood surface, you can mount this. Now regarding metal surfaces, they operate for metal surfaces with these premium earth magnets, which in a second will run outside. I mean, it's crappy out. It's like sleet, snow, and you know, Western New York, semi winter, whatever this season really is weather out. So it's a perfect test of this. Also for wood surfaces, for like your duck blinds or you know, your gun shacks for deer hunting, etc., you have let me show up from the front. You can see right here and right here, there's screws. They also give you three, so it looks like you get one extra screw. So you can screw this into a wood surface. So you could have this in your duck blind or deer shack, whatever you want. It is very versatile with being able to be used with the magnets for metal surfaces or, or the screws for any wood surface. So that's pretty sweet. We are gonna put one of these in the duck blind down there. You can see on the inside here, on every bracket, if you will, there is TPE, which if you're a fisherman, you know that material. It's really strong, it's really rigid, but it's soft. It's really soft, so you're not gonna beat up your gun barrel. It's, say you put this on there and you lay it up there. It's got protection there. Also, you have an adjustable strap, four holes of adjustment, and you can just strap that down you can strap that down as well to hold them in place. The only use I could see for this for us is in our gun safes, putting these, using the earth magnets to secure it to the side of the gun safe, putting our firearms in these and then strapping it down just for added support. You know, they ain't going nowhere. So other than that, I'll probably take the strap off for the duck blind because you got to be able to get your gun off quick. For the pattern series, I could see it too because it makes sure our guns can't fall off or anything like that. I do like the fact that you can see this rubber cushion. So not only do you have the magnets, but it, you have a barrier in between the magnets and this base and whatever metal surface you're applying this to, whether it's your gun safe, whether it's uh, a bar you ran across your duck blind or your truck, the side of your truck. You know, you don't want it being beaten up that surface. So it's nice to see that, that cushion right there. Regarding the Shotgun Buddy Pro from OTDR, this sucker right here is a lot of bang for your buck. Now, like I said, I'm gonna put the link down to the Amazon link where I purchased these down in the description, so check it out. But before you get there, I just wanna let you know they're $29.95 a piece, and really guys, it's worth it. All right, so let me go grab the Franke Affinity 3. We'll go put this on the side of the truck. We'll test it out. And this is a perfect test for it because it's not sunshine and warm out. It's once again, that weird season that you don't really know if you should call it fall, spring, 
winner of Western New York. If you guys are from here, you know what I'm talking about. It's, what is it out right now? It's 42 and it's sleeting. It was snowing this morning and I think it's supposed to be 50 this weekend. So it's just a weird weather, but it's perfect to test out these magnets, especially on the wet surface of my truck. Let's go test this bad boy out. I'm eager. Stay tuned. We'll catch you outside. All right, guys. So I decided to change it up and how I was going to do it. Let me get you a little closer. I just got to keep the camera out of the, the wet. Okay, that's a little better. So we got the orange one. I didn't think that actually worked, but that worked. <laughs> so it's, as you can see, this is wet. I mean, that's soaked. Let me, let me just zoom in for verification. As you can tell, it's still raining. And uh, that's what, the only time it comes loose is when it hits that contour. So we'll say this. In inclement weather, wet conditions, sleet, snow, it seems to work just fine on my truck. And I mean, I just got home from driving, so so she's 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 moist, if you will. But here we go. I got three guns, three of my favorite turkey guns for this test. As you can see, unloaded 410. You guys know how much I love this little guy, Stevens 301 Turkey. Hollow Sun, and then Pattern Master Code Black Turkey. Patoo! Hammer. So this is a really light gun. Let's get, that might be too tall for it. She's a little gun, so let's, let's bring her down. Okay, so there's the first gun. It does move if you were to wiggle it, but really guys, for what it's gonna be doing, as long as it doesn't fall off when it's setting on there, ain't going nowhere unless you're a little aggressive on removal. We're stepping up. Mossberg 500 20 gauge, my first ever gun. Uh, we got the Pattermaster Anaconda Striker on there. Absolutely phenomenal setup right here. This thing's filthy. If you haven't seen any of our turkey pattern tests, all three of these guns are on there and all these chokes are on there, except the Code Black Duck. Code Black Duck ain't on there. But that playlist will be down in the description below, so check it out. But this gun's a heavier gun. It's a lot heavier. This is actually the heaviest gun I'm going to put on it. But I love this 20 gauge. I shot my first turkey with this thing. Unloaded. Let's put her on there. Okay, so this gun's going to set up a little higher. Nothing. That's it's holding them strong. Now, lastly, is my 12 gauge that I use for waterfowl and turkey. So let's grab that. My Franke Affinity 3. Unloaded firearm. As you can see, we got shot cam on there and the Code Black Duck. I love this gun. Uh, this video, I'll put this video in the description below of this one too, as well as the 410. Uh, the 20 gauge I haven't done a review on, so I'm not putting that down below, but it is in the Turkey Pattern series, so check that playlist out. But this is my go-to gun. This is my baby. She's shoulders. Phenomenally. She's really light. Being able to put three shotguns. My original want and desire for this, this Shotgun Buddy Pro is right here. So when we're filming our pattern series, I drive my truck down to where we shoot. We have all, you know, the backers, the targets, the range finder, uh, the shooting setup, everything, guns, ammo, camera gear. We have everything jam-packed in my truck. And what I wanted to do is we were just resting our guns like this on the truck. And it scratched the, the shit out of my truck. Now, mind you, I don't really care about cosmetics. I just didn't like the idea of our guns falling, our red dots banging around and messing up the pattern series. So I was looking into this. I never pulled the trigger. I finally did. And I'm, think, I'm happy I did. Guys, look at this. This is, it's snow rain out. We got three guns on there. That middle one's the heaviest gun by far, but we got three guns on there. Ain't going nowhere. So regarding the earth magnets in this setup, this is lights out, guys. For $29.95, this bad boy right here is a steal. Now, 
For most people, the shotgun buddy, the, just the solo, would be the way to go. But if you're like us, you, you like getting together with friends, shooting clay pigeons, etc. Like, we live out in the sticks, so we shoot in my lawn and my fields all the time. So it's nothing to have a need to put three guns on the side of a truck. And this is a safe manner to do it because you're not going to have guns sliding off. That, that's what it's all comes down to is safety. So, And guys, if you really wanted to put that strap on and secure these firearms you have a lot of adjustability you got those four the shot cams kind of in the way but there is with the strap actually on as you can see the shot cams kind of in the way on that but that's holding those right tight so you can utilize that option if this is your first video with us I'm Jake Sleesman Blue Collar Outdoors nice to meet you hope you stay for a while we got plenty of things outdoors we have our hunts we also have some playlists that hold a lot of value in the broadhead test series. That's We have a ton of broadheads in there, and that's ever-growing. We have our turkey and waterfowl pattern tests. Both have a different playlist, and we separated the waterfowl in duck loads and goose loads because there is a big difference. All those, you know, all those series are ever-growing, so if any of that intrigues you, hit that subscribe button. Hit the notification bell so you do not miss out on any of our Monday or Wednesday uploads during the season. In the off season, we put the grind on. It's Monday, Wednesday, Friday, and we've been known to throw in random videos no matter what time of year it is. So the notification bell is huge so you do not miss out on videos as they drop. But if you haven't already, make sure to smash the thumbs up button. Don't do it for me. Do it for the OTDR shotgun buddy pro having to be out here holding my three turkey guns in uh new york sunshiny weather and doing an outstanding job doing it i wish i would have bought one sooner but i'm happy i have them now so this is jake Sleesman, blue collar outdoors and like i said at the beginning all the links that you could be curious about will be down in the description below guys drop a comment let me know if you have one of these let me know your experiences with them. It's time to eat some dinner, and I got chest and back, so we got to get after it. Jake Sleesman, Blue Collar Outdoors, and as always, guys, we'll catch you on the next one. Keep grinding.